Mas Love Wine TV. How are you guys? Hopefully everybody's doing okay. Actually, great. I'm doing awesome. Uh, you can just uh, <laughs> look at Tina and what, what are you gonna do? Just smile. How are you, Tina, today? Good, wonderful. That's great. So you have some chocolate. Are you gonna feed some yeah, today? Yeah, you know, I, I know you like chocolate a lot, <laughs> so I thought to please your palate with this uh, today. <laughs> uh, something fun, something different. We're gonna match some flavor to some wines, and I actually gonna tell you to do the same home, especially if you have friends home, a little party, it's something fun to do home, you know, and uh, entertain people. It's great, it's very simple. Uh, for example, get some vanilla sticks, some coffee beans, and some chocolate or cocoa powder, and that's all you need, that's all you need. And you're gonna be surprised how wine sometimes can be so close to food or spices or any kind of flavor or flower sometimes and uh, actually Tina I would like to uh, challenge your sense and start with uh, my Chardonnay and uh, my vanilla that always works it's incredible it is you can, I can actually smell it it's um, it's unbelievable <clears throat> how flavor sometimes can be so close it's, and that's why a lot of people sometimes ask me, Berto, did they put vanilla into the wine? No, they don't put any vanilla into the wine, they don't put any coffee into the wine, they don't put any chocolate into the wine. It's just that the grape and the soil, they remind you so close to any particular mm -hmm. flavors, and it's just perfect, perfect. It's beautiful vanilla sticks from Madagascar, and beautiful Lawson Ranch from Monterey County, 2005. Great price, $12.50. $12.50, guys. Awesome, awesome Chardonnay. It's good to take to the BYO Bay. Exactly. Actually, that's what we're going to do tonight, right? If your you boyfriend doesn't catch me. <laughs> <laughs> Second, I would like to, um, you to smell the coffee beans and the uh, second wine in sample, which is actually a beautiful Cabernet Sauvignon, Nieto Centenaire, 2005. It's a beautiful reserve from Mendoza, Argentina. Again, a great area for winemaking and for price and quality. This is a $10 bottle of wine, guys. You can't go wrong. And it's fun to do at home. Do it with your friends. They're going to be so surprised. It's unbelievable. It's what amazing you how you can pull the scent out of the wine. Um, because you would always... I've, I love wine, but I don't really know what's in it. So you would think, you know, it's only grapes, but... And you know, but you can many really people, smell the coffee and the vanilla. Right, right. <clears throat> and many people come to me, oh, I like something that is some chocolate or coffee to it. That's the best way how to know what you like. And it's all about what you like. There's no rating, it's, no, it's your palate. It's everything on your taste. <clears throat> We're going to finish with chocolate, Tina, your favorite. Big bottle of wine. Uh, this is probably a little bit uh, out of our range most of the time, but sometimes you have to treat yourself. That's why I picked this wine. It's a great Amarone coming from Veneto in Italy in 2001, single vineyards estate, huge wine, serious wine making, 30, over $30 price point. What do you think? I see your Can smile. You yeah. yeah, it's beautiful, <laughs> dark cocoa. That's good. Yeah, it's drinking chocolate. It's unbelievable, unbelievable. So, isn't it amazing, Tina? Mm -hmm. I'm try some Please feel free. Actually, I'll share a piece with you. Actually. Mm -hmm. Mm. Uh, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much, guys, and sorry for my full mouth. You must love mm -hmm. wine because wine loves you. Have a wonderful day.